floor standing speakers sit directly on the floor without a separate stand. They're often called tower speakers because the enclosures are typically tall and narrow. Floor standing speakers usually contain multiple drivers such as dedicated woofers, tweeters, and mid-range drivers. The large enclosure of floor standing speakers usually allows them to produce more bass than other speakers. A bookshelf speaker almost always has a smaller enclosure than a floor standing speaker. These speakers usually contain a woofer and tweeter, although some models may also include a mid-range driver. The smaller enclosure of bookshelf speakers limits their bass output. A bookshelf speaker can also be used as a surround sound speaker. This adds sound behind and to the sides of the listener. Other options for surround speakers include bipole and dipole. The drivers in bipole and dipole speakers are arranged in pairs facing different directions. In some cases, such as our signature series bipolar speakers, there is a front facing woofer and two tweeters aiming in different directions. In bipolar speakers, the tweeter is the most important driver because the sounds that you want to be directional come from the tweeter. In this configuration, the listener hears almost no sound directly from the speaker, only sound reflected from the walls, ceiling, and floor, which makes the sound more spacious. The difference between dipole and bipole is that dipole speakers fire their drivers out of phase, whereas bipole speakers are in phase. Bipole and dipole speakers are often mounted directly to the wall. A subwoofer reproduces very low frequencies that are below what a typical woofer can handle. Because the subwoofer's frequency range is so narrow, most have just a single driver in an enclosure. The long wavelengths of the deep bass tones that the subwoofer produces emanate equally in all directions, so the driver doesn't need to face the listener. In fact, some subwoofers have downward facing drivers. For more great videos from Fluence, be sure to subscribe or click here.